Are you afraid of the dark? Are you scared? What's up, everybody? For the Winitachi here, you know what it is. Thank you all very much for tuning in. The call for allies is here for the Alliance side. But we're going to be doing this quest. So we're going to meet King Rin at the Stormwind Embassy, just like we did with the High Mountain Torn, and just like we did with the Nightborn for the Horde. At the Horde Embassy, we're going to be doing the same thing for the Lightforged Draenei and the Void Elves for the Alliance. So without further ado, um, when you log in for this new uh, patch, and this well, not a new patch, but this new update, for those that have already pre-ordered Battle for Azeroth, you'll be automatically given the quest, either uh, the Call for Allies, Alliance, or Horde, and uh, go ahead and adventure to your Stormwind or Orvamar Embassy. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get in there. Thank you for joining us, Champion. These are dire times indeed. We all know the Alliance incurred heavy losses in the war against the Legion. And even now, the world bleeds in the aftermath of Sargeras's final strike. Meanwhile, the Horde musters its forces and arms for war. Their aggression must not go unanswered. Our future depends on bringing other like-minded allies into the fold. I call upon those of you gathered here for your suggestions. Victory on Argus was only possible because the heroes of Azeroth fought side by side with the Army of the Light. Many of our bravest soldiers gave their lives for the cause. Those who remain would be proud to join the Alliance. Among our number are brave initiates about to undertake the arduous path of becoming Lightforged. Thank you, High Exarch. Lightforged soldiers would indeed bring strength to our numbers. High King, I remember the days when my people and yours fought together against the Horde. I reached out to them in hopes of seeing Silvermoon return to the Alliance. My efforts proved futile. But I did learn of a group of Sindori who have been exiled for studying the Void as I have. If I could locate them, their knowledge might aid our cause. Stormwind has suffered at the hands of those who succumb to the Shadow's Whispers. But if others could master its power as you have, they would make formidable allies. What Thank the fuck? you both for your counsel. I would like to hear our champion's perspective on which of these potential allies we should reach out to first. Wait, whoa, whoa, hold up. Illyria Windwinner? Now I understand your whole freaking storyline. I'm glad I did Horde first. So, if you have an option of doing either Horde or Alliance first, I suggest you do the Horde first. Because once you do the Nightborn, you will see a little bit more Valyria Windrunner in that. And oh my gosh, is there some stories to tell? If you don't know what I'm talking about, make sure you go ahead and tune into that. Wow, Valyria Windrunner is the biggest backstabber I've ever seen. I actually liked the Windrunners. Especially because it's so honest, but... Be vigilant. Damn, fam. Alright, speak with Turalyon and Illyria to learn more about potential allies. So, I mean, the you could, of, of course, just go ahead and click on them. Each walk a line. And learn more Choose about them. Yours. Or you can go ahead and use the Lightforge Draenei flag or banner or the Void Elf flag or banner. So without further ado, let's get to it. Alrighty, so we got the Lightforge Draenei fighting a long bitter war against the Burning Legion, these Draenei soldiers were infused with the Holy Light to become living weapons victorious at last. These Lightforged stand ready to defend Azeroth. So with the uh, Lightforged Draenei, you will notice that they have the racial traits of Light's Judgment deal mighty holy damage to an area, kind of like Consecration for Paladins. Light's Reckoning erupt upon death. Dealing holy damage to nearby enemies and healing nearby allies. That is real cool. Holy resistance reduces holy damage taken. Makes absolute sense. Forge of Light increases blacksmithing skill and allows you to summon an anvil. Really cool. And Demon Bane increases experience gain from killing demons. I mean, I guess that'll help when I get to Legion content or Burning Crusade content. So, in order to unlock this uh, new allied race, you have to get and complete the achievements. Uh, you are now prepared, which is simply completing all of the Argus questline on any character on your account, as well as get exalted with the Army of the Light, which is on Argus. 
So here is what a light forged Draenei male looks like. And to be honest, they are really cool looking. They look exactly like Draenei, but with that holy feel. And then of course we got the female counterpart as well. Again, looking exactly like a normal and regular Draenei, but with that holy feel. So turning in the quest, I am ready to pursue our next ally. In Stormwind. First of all, we're gonna go with the Light Forge Draenei. Get into that. Turn in the quest. Cause is always worth fighting for. Kronikai Crystal. Take up the next quest. Walk in the I am light. eager for the Light Forge to join the Alliance. Turalyon, bring our champion with you to the Vindicar so that you may address your troops together. It will be done, High King. This way, champion. Well, that was quick compared to the Horde. Man, Horde, you just have to do so much more stuff. Maria, I need a beacon to the Vindicar. At once, High Exarch. What the hell? The Alliance actually get the- you were correct. The Alliance actually get portals to their location. The Horde, I never got a portal to my location now. I did not expect you back so soon, High Exarch. I assume your meeting with the King went well? Indeed. He is eager to have the Army of the Light fighting on the side of the Alliance. Assemble our forces, Captain, and I will make the announcement. You know how fond I am of your speeches, but can it wait? We were just about to send these initiates to undertake the trials. Ah, well this is excellent timing, Champion. You can see firsthand what it means for a soldier to become Lightforged. Proceed, Faria. All right, so let's go ahead and turn in this quest. And next up, a bear witness to the ritual of the Light Forge. My fellow soldiers, the trials you have endured are proof that the light shines bright within your hearts. One final test remains, and it is the most daunting of all. It will force you to peer into the very core of what you are, of what you believe yourself to be. Many worthy Draenei have undergone this trial, only to return broken, or worse. Should you feel the slightest doubt, turn back now. It will be counted as wisdom, not cowardice. But if you are truly ready, step forward and embrace your fate. Tapartos, we have discussed this. Each initiate must be accompanied by a second. Where is yours? Tapartos needs no one to aid him. <laughs> the last initiate who attempted the trial alone came back in pieces. Choose a second or head back to the barracks. I think that's where we come in. So be it. The Bardo shall bring uh, this puny one. An unorthodox choice, but technically within the rules. I have never known our champion to back down from a challenge. Champion for 20 begin. for like two hours, fam. Light be with you both. Nah, champion for like 30 minutes. <laughs> uh, I've been a champion for like 30 minutes, boys. Insta boosted my mage, and I'm already a champion. So, Alright, so here we go. Getting in. I'm assuming this is going to be like a cool little scenario for us to mess around with. With a loading screen of death that takes like five years. Here we go. Alright, cool. First time playing a mage in here. Tepartos did not choose you because of your puniness. Tepartos saw your heart on the field of battle. You are the bravest hero Tepartos has ever seen. Ooh, she. Pain is the architect of memories. Tepartos remembers a place like uh. this. Ooh. no kindness here dude these guys call them fat fam fat shaming over here not always kind to Tepartos. go 
Tepartos thinks he knows what little Tepartos might do. Can you stop talking in a third person, fam? Like, for real. What are we doing? Ah. Uh. We have to fight! I have no clue how this stack works. Okay, so use that on. Okay. For solace. So there's still procs. There's still a proc stack. Oh, this is still a prospect, fam. Likes the partos. The partos make soon and nine happy. <laughs> Absolutely funny. That all he does is third first in the entire run. I've already seen this one. <laughs> I don't know where you went, the partos. Oh my! I don't know what I'm doing with my mage. Okay, so I got my five icicles. Max, you can store his five, so I'm assuming. Again, last time I played a mage, long time ago. The Partos made friends with critters, frogs, elek, bugs, but not snakes. Never snakes. Why not snake? I don't like snakes either, so it's okay. Yeah, okay, we're gonna get a slain serpent. Is there no comment? Oh wait, no, I don't want to use it. I don't want to use that ability. Okay, never want to use that. This is when I want to use that ability. Okay, same thing with Ice Man. Alright, got it. Got it! Bella says hi, she's watching too. Awesome! I'm sorry. Do we not have evocation anymore? Find comfort. Do mages not have evocation? What's going on here? I, I need I need health, fam. How do you get health as a mage? Was scared. He found a place to hide. Ooh. Distraction provides escape. Tepartos remembers a place like this one. A time he dug too deep. I uh, yeah I got it. I I I have health potions too, so I got that there. Oh no. Oh no. No. Alright, so this, I think this even bolt procs that. Alright, cool. Awesome, I understand my spec already. And then this is just when I want to go ham. <laughs> oh, it's so. Yeah, that's just when I want to go ham. darkness be stopped? Ah, oh, this is cool. Mage back. I'm learning. Was Tepartos meant to walk this path? Is Tepartos worthy to become Lightforged? You are worthy, bro. Everybody's worthy. Alright, so anything can really proc this. Otherwise, I have to cast it. It's alright, though. So I always want to start with even bolt, get it on cooldown, and just go ham. Uh, what is barking, my stupid pet? To be honest, I kind of uh, ignored it this whole time. I'll change it out though. I got a good pet. It's my fire bat pup. It won't talk anymore. All right, so I gotta kill this. A very easy spec to play now that I know it. This is Frozen Orb. Alright. Shit. I mean, such an easy spec to play. It's fun though. It, it had not much has changed. They've just been given a couple of abilities that I don't know where. That I just don't remember playing back in Wrath of Lich King days. But it's very similar. Would you really have to fear me though, bro? Alright. Go ahead and pop a cooldown on this one. 
I'm so glad I insta leveled a, a mage. Uh, you also never ran out of mana. Yeah, true. That is absolutely true, especially because you don't have evocation anymore. No other means of really getting mana back. Arcane deserves to run out of mana though. So, Ebon Bolt deals frost damage and causes brain freeze, which is how I'm able to use Flurry. Unleash a Flurry of Ice, striking the target three times in a total. Okay, uh, while brain freeze is active, Flurry applies winter chill, causing your target to take damage from your spells as if it were frozen. Awesome, so when I do have uh, brain freeze, it's an insta attack anyway. That is great. Stop fearing me. Face the fists of Tapartos. Ooh, what if we get a kill? This way? In oh. solitude, the answer. No one can hurt this way. You if you remain. You have an interrupt. I do, I know. It is counter spell. Oh wait, no. Yeah. Counter spell. I just, I just haven't looked. I haven't used it. We're really lazy when it comes to stuff like that. I can sheep it. I can sheep it. Relax. It's good. Keep it there. Down with five dogs. Depart Toshi Scoop. Depart Toast. Why do you gotta be so stoop? Alright, let's go finish this off, boys. Safe, secure. Ooh, away there's the freaking terror. Right, I'm ready to kill this place. Everything. All right, here we go. Bloodlust. Come on, bring it over here, boy. Fear is relentless, unyielding, a foe to be defeated. Wait, what the hell? Why do you get no? No, I did all the work, bro. That is my loot. My loot. This guy jacking my loot. No one said you can jack my hopelessness. There is respite. Alright, where are we going? I gotta know. Hey, he's pretty quick. This guy is pretty quick. I might need to dark fight you. We didn't need to kill this, by the way. We could have avoided this. You're the order hall companion now. <laughs> Why are we killing things? Alright, I'm absolutely loving Frost because it took me like two seconds to figure out how to play this spec. I was like so scared there was all these new abilities. Nah fam. This is easy mode. What is he doing? He keeps running into everything. I guess he didn't want to run into that one. I went into the so bro. Wait. The ancient guide, I'm able to see it. Perhaps to overcome fear. Wait. Oh never mind, that is the ancient guide. <laughs> one must embrace it. Wait, what? What is going on? What is it? I don't like this. I need to target something first. Target 
Oh my god. Uh, he's. Oh, you can't heal up. All right, here we go. Healing potion. Three, two, one. I should be given a barrier. Alright, awesome. Kill this too. Alright, that was pretty close to be honest. I could have died today. Could have taken some owls, boys. Dude, can you stop pulling, fam? I'm doing a lot of work here. I'm a mage. I just insta level. I'm not a true champion like my warlock over here. Alright, watch. You don't pull this too. This guy. This guy. I I did all the way. Departos no! needs to shut up. An offer refuted. Dude online, you said this was gonna be so much worse than the horde versions. I'm actually liking this, dude. I'm liking this. This is fun stuff. I'm loving this actually. You really like the high mountain one. Oh, he, he's avoiding things. Oh, nope, he didn't avoid. He didn't avoid squat, boys. He didn't avoid shit. You like the high mountain one. Uh, no, no, no. I said Light Forge is 9 out of 10. Oh, the boy. So you're saying I'm saving the worst for last right now? That's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, this thing needs to die, boys. Dude, I'm scared when I play this mage. But yeah, you're saying I just, uh... The worst one for last, that's not a good sign. I hope I like the Void out, and I'm not with your opinion on it. Because right now, my order is... Nightborn, Lightforge, Draenei, and High Mountain. And the only reason why I didn't like High Mountain is there's a lot of storyline to it. And it was really long. What the hell just happened? I looked down at my chat and just my screen started flickering. Within one soul exist many truths. Some noble. Uh oh. We have to fight! Hopefully these guys don't got a knockback. I mean, I know I got slow fall and everything, but I'm being for wheelies. Battle for Azeroth, Ally Bracing, man. I'm so glad I did this. Dude, stop running away and forcing me to kill everything. Uh, I gotta really kill these guys quick. I don't like how my screen flickers like that though, boy. I'm using these health potions like crazy. I can barely handle this. Oh, I forgot. Wait, does my pet still have... Oh, nope, it doesn't. My pet doesn't have the AoE in That kind of sucks, to be honest. Are we killing those things? Oh, no, that's just... Okay, I get it. Never mind. We're seeing things from his path as well. My bad, boys. Alright, that was done. I'm just gonna pull this just in case. Uh, your pet might have more abilities. Okay, yeah, I will. Nope, that's it. We used to have an AOE uh, freeze with pet back in the day. Back in the day. And it seems to me we don't got that anymore.
Alright, well that's all of those. Go ahead and use this. Uh, restore health. Mana. Alright, not too bad. Departos can lift mountains. How long is this, by the way? Like, how much more do I got? It is taking a long time. A long scenario. It's not that bad, but I just I just went here. Uh, almost done. All right, cool, yeah. It's not short, I've noticed. It's not as long as the high mountain one though. Nothing's as long as that one. So far. <laughs> this is slightly embarrassing for Tepartos. <laughs> uh, were those strippers or something? Face the fists of Tepartos! What was that? Wait, what was that? What did I just miss out on? I didn't look at what they were. Does this game have strippers? They do? What? Dude, Blizzard's got jokes! Can you make the snakes go away? Blizzard's got jokes, boys. <laughs> Blizzard's got jokes. Oh no, I pulled too much. Go this quick. Uh, get in front and pop him. Got a bubble. Well, I don't know why I casted that. Uh, did you not see the storyline where you punched Deathwing? And I did. I did. I remember that. That is uh, burning stuff, if I'm not mistaken. I remember that. Where you, where you keep doing it too? Alright, these aren't strippers. They just. I don't know. This is not real. This cannot be the true Tepartos. What am I missing out on? I'm missing something here. Does the path lead to greatness? Wait. Go oh. Now. This is Tepartos the Fallen. Oh no. I'm gonna have to last, boys. It's Tepartos the Fallen. Such power awaits. Ma Magi is shit. Oh, the Rankos. Come on now. I love spellcasters. It's the only reason why I played a mage. I, I created a mage for this. Only reason why. Mirror image. Well, I don't have mirror image right now, bro. I got rid of it. For now. Because I only wanted passive ability. But now that I know all my abilities, rotation in like two seconds. Oh no, oh shit. I might die, boys. BT, uh, Black Temple is definitely following the point. Alright, so I might die. This isn't good. Like, I don't think a mage can handle this. Shit. I have to play this like a smart mage now. I have to play this like a true frost mage right now, fam. I have to really move and groove. What? Talk Russia, I sadly can't. I sadly can't. Alright, Tepartos just came out of nowhere and just uh, won us that, that, that freaking box. I don't know what he did. But, uh, we did Gucci. Now what? Do you have something to report? You gotta, you gotta agree to me. I did all the work. Alright, return to Stormwind and speak to the king and do uh, dude. Might guide us. Alright. We all have darkness. Since us, that was it, it no easy thing I'm now gonna start saying to Nightborn, High Mountain, and, and Lightforge Draenei. I don't think this beats the High Mountain. Sadly, I don't think it does. 
From this day forth, you are light forged. Alright, he's light forged, fam. Alright, I mean, this wasn't amazing, but it was so cool. Alright, so we have made it back to Andrew and Rin. Stormwind honors your service. Gonna be given our light forged bell crusher, and then uh, we will also be given an achievement. So without further ado. Safe journey. The army of the light is pledged to defend the alliance. The strength of the light forged is most welcome in our ranks, High Exarch. I have fought beside these Draenei in the Twisting Nether for a thousand years. You will find no soldiers who are more skilled or more loyal. Loyal. Both these qualities will be needed in the days to come. Another one. And thank you for your part in bringing them to our cause, champion. For the Alliance. For the Alliance. Awesome. I still rank that as third best. But... We have been just given our allied races light forge draenei so that is now three out of the four completed also be given our mount check out what it looks like oh light forge fell crusher and it's this big huge fat thing man i didn't think it was gonna be that i thought it was gonna be like a legit fell crusher but it's just a big fat rhinoceros hippo thing damn draenei why do you gotta be why do you gotta be doing this to me but anyways, just last but not least, don't forget, once you have leveled up your Lightforge Draenei from 20 to 110, you will be given the transmog set that you currently see on the screen for the males and for the females to use in all future Lightforge Draenei that you go ahead and create. So without further ado, get to leveling, get to unlocking, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.